Hey everyone, and welcome to True, your 30-day yoga journey. Salud, it's day seven. Today we're gonna get our heart rate up and we're gonna focus on insight through repetition. So hop into something comfy and let's get started. All right, my friends, let's begin today in a nice, comfortable seat of your choice. As you come into your seat, take a second to get settled in. And we're gonna place just one palm on top of the other, really easy in your lap. And you'll start to lengthen up through the spine. Sit up as tall as you can and relax your shoulders down. Just take a moment to allow your energy to settle here in this moment. I like the image of like a snow globe Shake it up, shake it up, and boom, now we've landed here and the snow begins to fall, or if you prefer glitter, we can do that. Whatever it is, just allowing the dust even to settle. And if you notice that your mind is kind of busy today, then today's practice is gonna be quite good for you. Working with repetition in order to create insight and eventually find freedom within the form. Gently bow the head to the heart and think of something that you would like to toast to, to cheers to. I made the joke about salud Cheers to your health, or is there something more specific that you'd like to bow to, cheers to, dedicate your practice to today? Take a moment to explore that thought. And then take a deep breath in. And as you exhale, open your eyes, lift your chin. If something came up, awesome. Let's move with that. If nothing came up, that's okay. All right, we're gonna come all the way into downward facing dog. Here we go. Take your time getting there. Move nice and slow. Move like you love yourself. <clears throat> Plant the palms with so much attention and awareness. Claw through the fingertips and lift the hips up high. We'll start to pedal it out right away here. Shake the head loose. Find what feels good. Listen to your body today. Listen to your heart, your truth. And to do that, we'll start to create an audible breath. Something you can anchor the mind in, help anchor the mind. That could be busy thoughts wandering here and there. Totally normal. So we use the sound of our breath to keep returning back on home. All right, bend the knees, lift the heels. Come onto the toes, inhale, look forward. And exhale, make your way to the top. Relax the weight of the head over. Shake the head loose a couple times, left and right. Find your footing. Nice deep breaths here. Then we'll bend the knees generously. Belly comes to the tops of the thighs. Tuck the chin into the chest, and you got it. Slowly roll it up. Press firmly into your feet. Gently draw some energy up from the base of the spine. Lengthen through the crown. And here we go. Left fingertips are gonna reach forward up and then you're gonna kind of swim it back here, opening up through the shoulder. Now right fingertips forward, up and swim it back. And then keep it going here and try to add this layer of breath, let your breath and movement synchronize here. Inhaling and exhaling, inhaling and exhaling. Now keep it going, you're gonna trace your fingertips with your gaze, integrating the neck, 
Take it nice and slow as you experiment here. Awesome, then release, bring it back to center. Our hands are gonna press together. Anjali Mudra at the heart. Deep breath in, engage. Create a full body experience by lifting all of your toes, drawing energy up from the arches. Then release the toes down nice and slow. We'll create a soft bend in the knees here, and here we go, inhale, reach for the sky. Find a big beach ball up and overhead here just to start. Pull the thumbs back, press into the heels. So strong, strong, strong body here in volcano pose. Inhale, look up. Exhale, palms come together. We're gonna bend the knees and slowly melt it all the way down. Great, inhale, halfway lift. Find length, exhale to fold. Then plant the palms, step the right toes back, step the left toes back, you're in plank. Take a deep breath in and a long breath out here as you press away from your yoga mat. Beautiful, then slowly lower all the way to the belly. Press into the tops of the feet, hug the elbows in, inhale, cobra. Exhale to release. Inhale, press up to half plank or plank. Then exhale to downward facing dog, awesome. Inhale to look forward. Exhale to bend the knees and hop or step it up. Inhale, lifts you up halfway. Exhale, Uttanasana, forward fold. Inhale, bend the knees, lead with the thumbs, energy in the fingertips as you root to rise here, reach for the sky, big beach ball up and overhead. And then exhale, hands to heart. Take a deep breath in here and empty it out. Let's go again, shall we? Bend the knees, inhale, reach for the sky. Strong body, exhale, palms together, soften and fold. Inhale, halfway lift, find length, your version. And exhale, soften and bow. Beautiful, plant the palms, step the right toes back, step the left toes back, plank or half plank. Take a deep breath in, then exhale, slowly lower down to the belly. Inhale, cobra. Exhale, release. Inhale, plank or half plank. Exhale to your downward dog. Inhale to look forward, bend the knees. Exhale to make your way to the top. Stick with me, inhale, halfway lift. Exhale to soften and fold. Inhale, root to rise, energy in the fingertips. Here we go, press into the earth. And exhale, hands to heart. Take a deep breath in here. And then use your exhale to empty it all out. We go again, big inhale, reach for the sky. Exhale, down you go, forward fold. Big inhale to lift up halfway. Exhale, soften and fold. Plant the palms, inhale as you step it back to plank. Look forward, exhale, lower to the belly or chaturanga. Inhale, cobra or up dog. And exhale to your downward dog. Inhale to look forward, bend the knees, and exhale, make your way to the top. Inhale, halfway lift, find length. Exhale to soften and fold. Bend the knees, inhale, reach for the sky. Exhale, hands to heart. Take a deep breath in. Relax the shoulders as you breathe out. The journey continues. So now we can start to find different flavors, different rasas between um, each beat of the repetition of the dance. So maybe that means you do something different with your hands. Maybe you hook the thumbs. Maybe you play with something different on the halfway lift. Or maybe it's, um, yeah, maybe, maybe send the fingertips back in your cobra. So find something to play with while staying in the structure. And then just when you think like, oh, I got this, <laughs> see if you can find something new. So don't decide where it ends, but we're gonna stay within this structure. Again, seeking insight within the repetition, a uh, little freedom within the form. Here we go again. 
getting the heart rate up. Great for the body. Hands come together if they are not still. And here we go. Take a deep breath in. Empty it out. Bend the knees. Inhale, reach for the sky. Synchronize with your breath. Exhale, forward fold. Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale, fold. Inhale, step back to plank. Exhale, lower down. Inhale, cobra or up dog. Exhale to release. Inhale in again. Exhale, downward dog. Inhale to look forward. Exhale to make your way to the top. Inhale to find length. And exhale to let it all go. Inhale, reach for the sky. Exhale, hands to heart. Deep breath in. Close your eyes as you exhale out. Inhale, reach for the sky. So I'm not going to change it up on you now. Exhale, fold. Listen to your body. Catch the rhythm. Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale to fold. Inhale, plank pose. Exhale, lower down. Inhale, tug the shoulders back, open the chest. Exhale, release. Inhale, use your exhale to make your way to downward dog. Inhale to bend the knees, look forward. Exhale to make your way to the top. Nice work, inhale, halfway lift, you got it. Exhale to fold, stick with me. Inhale, reach for the sky, find something new. Exhale, gather it in, hands to heart. Close your eyes, trust me, inhale, trust yourself. Exhale, trust the video, you know what you're doing. And here we go, inhale, reach for the sky. Exhale, forward fold. Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale, soften and bow. Inhale, plank pose or half plank. Exhale, lower down. Inhale to open your heart. Exhale to release. Inhale. And exhale, downward facing dog. Awesome work here. Take a deep breath in. Stay here in your dog as you exhale out through the mouth. <sighs> inhale to bend the knees, look forward. And exhale to make your way to the top. Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale to fold. Inhale, reach for the sky. Just catch a wave here and then exhale, take it all the way down. Now we're gonna change it up just a bit here. Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale, fold. Plant the palms, step it back, plank pose. Belly to cobra, chaturanga to up dog or move with your breath straight to downward dog. That's where we'll meet. Anchoring heavy down through the heels, clawing through the fingertips. Now, when you get there, anchor through the left heel and inhale, lift the right leg high. Exhale, step it all the way up, pivot on the back foot, rise up, warrior one. Inhale, and exhale. Inhale, and exhale to rain it all the way down. Step it back, inhale, look forward. Exhale, straight to down dog. Anchor the right heel, inhale, lift the left leg high. Exhale, shift forward, step it up. Then pivot on the back foot, gather your strength and reach for the sky, warrior one. Inhale, exhale, relax your shoulders. <sighs> inhale, reach up, look up. Exhale, bring it all the way down. You're doing awesome, plant the palms, step it back, plank pose. Inhale, look forward. Exhale to your down dog. Awesome, take a deep breath in here. And exhale out through the mouth. <sighs> Beautiful, inhale to look forward, bend the knees. Exhale to make your way to the top. Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale, fold, press into the earth, root to rise, inhale, reach for the sky. And exhale, hands to heart. Now, don't let it go here. Don't fidget. Capture this energy. Notice your breath. Observe. Observe. 
Cheers. Without looking down today, so keep your chin lifted. And to that, and like to that inner knowing, that truth, little things like this help us connect to that, in my opinion. So you don't need to look down to bring your feet together. Don't do it, here we go. Lift your head and bring your feet together without looking. And it kind of just changes the way you feel when you do it. More on that later. Shift your weight to your left foot and slowly peel the right knee up. So coming into a tree pose, it can be toes on the earth, it could be foot on the calf, or maybe you grab that ankle and draw it all the way up towards the center. Then press back, find that opposition, what this series is all about. Press back, find that marriage in the middle of two opposing forces coming together. Lengthen down through the back body, lift up through the front body. Control your breath. And within this structure that you've now built, find something that feels totally you today. So maybe it's eagle arms. Maybe it's just hands up high, just praising cheers to whatever it is you chose to toast to. Maybe the heart and chest need a little opening, feeling a little closed-minded about it all right now, opening through the chest. And maybe you're frustrated because you keep falling off balance, and so it's palms together. I got this. Hold on to a nice, strong focus. Gently lift some energy up from the pelvic floor. Inhale in, wherever you are, own it. And then exhale to bring it all back in. Cool experiment. Okay, next side. <laughs> Don't look down, feet together. Lift your heart. Shifting to the right foot now, same thing, but honor that this side's gonna be different. We can't recreate that experience. I think we try to do that a lot in yoga, and I know that I used to, and I have to remember this as a teacher or a guide. You're in charge of your experience, whatever's going on. So we can't recreate what happened on the other side. Explore. Play with the energy of the body. So we're hugging into the midline. We're lifting up from the pelvic floor. Play with your focus, your drishti, and then find something awesome on this side too. Maybe it's a mudra, maybe it's arms, maybe you go Wu-Tang, maybe it's cactus, maybe it's fist bump to you. Adrian, and to you, my friend. Whatever works. I'm speaking to a lot of people here, so I'm sending out a lot of different invites. So it's really up to you to own your own story throughout this practice. Take one more breath here, inhale. And then exhale to slowly release with control. Beautiful work. Inhale, reach for the sky, catch a wave. Exhale, float it down. Now you decide feet together or hip width apart. You're gonna bend the knees and you're gonna sink the hips back. Strong and steady, sink the hips back. Then here we go, engage the inner thighs as you sweep the fingertips forward and not back, just forward. And you're gonna sink the hips back, fingertips forward, and you're gonna balance your center of gravity between the two, the sinking back and the reaching forward. You got this. We're here for five. Scoop the tailbone under, four, three, look forward, two. Beautiful, thumbs up on the one, thumbs up. Come on now. All right, beautiful, release. Forward fold. Great, inhale, halfway lift, last one. Catch a wave here. And exhale to release. When I say catch a wave, I'm trying to get us to a little bit get out of the rigidity, the kind of segmented movement, and find more of a softness, or at least a movement that feels like you. Here we go, plant the palms, step it back, final plank, we got you, half plank or plank. Inhale to look forward, 
And then exhale, if you're in plank, slowly lower to the knees and everyone's gonna take their toes to one side, any side, and you're gonna send the legs out long and in front. Great, take the right arm over the left, give yourself a big hug. Flex your feet, sit up nice and tall. Inhale, lots of love in. Exhale, lots of love out. Then release, take the left arm on top. The most important relationship of all. Breathe. Fabulous, then release. Bring the fingertips to the ground and come to lie on your back. When you get there, hug the knees into the chest. Lift the corners of the mouth just a hair. Tap into that inner smile. Yeah. And then again, give yourself a big hug. Inhaling lots of love in. And this is a, a hug, a toast, a cheers to, yes, that most important relationship, the one with yourself. Take one more breath. Exhale, release both feet to the ground. <clears throat> and then we're going to slowly press the palms into the earth and just one bridge pose here so you can skip it if you like. We're gonna inhale, peel the tailbone up, hips up high, shins forward, snuggle the shoulder blades into your heart space, open your heart, your chest, keep an open mind as you look up towards your third eye. Breathing deep, chest to chin, chin to sky. Beautiful, take one more breath, inhale. And exhale to soften and release. <laughs> Beautiful. Cross the right ankle over the top of the left thigh. Thread the needle here. Imagine you're kicking your left foot into that imaginary wall and then squeeze the leg up towards your heart, your chest. You can start to close the eyes here and allow your breath to just soften, smooth out. And release the left foot down, unravel, switch to the other side. Close your eyes and relish in the power of showing up for yourself every day for 30 days. Or if it takes you a little bit longer, that's okay. But this idea of regular practice, regular self-care. Pretty awesome, totally awesome. Let's unravel. We're gonna send the legs out long. Inhale, reach for the sky, big full body stretch. Spread your fingertips, spread your toes. Inhale deeply. And then exhale, release everything completely. Traditional corpse pose today, just to allow your heart rate to soften and the body to relax here to allow the nutrients of your practice today to settle in, seep in. Rest your soul by simply allowing your breath to continue now with its natural ebb and flow. And then if time allows, you can stay here a little bit longer. Or if you're ready to mindfully get up and rock and roll throughout your day, we'll bring the palms together and lift the thumbs to the third eye. Inhale in. Then exhale to quietly whisper, Namaste. See you tomorrow.